Warning, if you're still using one of these rocket air blowers to blow dust from off of your camera sensors and your lenses, then you're probably doing a lot more harm than good. And trust me, do yourself a favor and toss this thing in the trash or just repurpose it like I did to blow dust from off of your computer keyboard because that's just about as much technical work as I would give to it. I know that over the years, this has been one of the best sellers. Whenever you ask for a recommendation of what should you do to blow dust from off your sensors and lenses, they would say get a rocket air blower, but trust me, they didn't know how dangerous this thing was because nobody told them. But now that I'm telling you, do it like this, throw it in the trash, and check this out. So this is the VS Go Falcon S and the VS Go Imp air blower. And in this video, I'm gonna show you why these are much different and safer for your lens and your sensors than the old air rocket air blowers of the past. Let's go. So I was just like you back in the days when I bought my first camera, everybody recommend go get a rocket air blower if you wanna blow dust out of your sensors and lenses. And I went ahead and I bought one, but I've come to find out with a little research information that this is probably doing a lot more harm than good for your camera lenses and sensor. Let me explain. So here's the thing. Every time you squeeze this thing and let it go, it sucks in a lot of air along with particle pollution such as dust, dirt, soot, smoke, and sometimes liquid. And it may not seem like a really big deal right now, but just imagine over time pulling all that dust, dirt, soot, and all that crap and then dumping it on your sensor. Over time, you're gonna find out with more moisture and all that kind of stuff coming on your sensor. And then you find out one day you're doing a photo shoot and you see something on your sensor. And you realize you have a dirty ass sensor. And what's the cause? Because you've been using uh, that rocket air blower that everybody recommends. And I mean, different environments have way more or less of the above mentioned particles, but I think you get the point every time you go puff puff on your sensor and your lenses. I think you get it. It's, it's dirty enough. Just saying. So do yourself a favor and jump on Amazon right now. I'm gonna leave a link down in the description and get yourself one of these Falcon S rocket air blowers from VS Go, or you get yourself the Imp, and I know what you're gonna say. Isn't that a different version of the same rocket air blower? And the answer is yes, but no. So yes, they are a similar puff puff style rocket air blower like the rocket air blower of the past, but the no is these were designed by VS Go and they've figured out a way how to put a filter inside of these, a replaceable filter inside of these. And what does that do? And they have also re-engineered a few different aspects of the blower to make it a little bit more effective and safer for use. Number one, there is a one-way air inlet on the air filter that can prevent particles from entering into the air blower, which reduce the possibility of sucking in any kind of pollutants versus the regular old rocket air blower that has an open inlet at the bottom and the top nozzle that just sucks everything in and blow it back out on your sensor. And Length. And the second reason to get this one over the outdated rocket air blower, you also get two replacement nozzles of different lengths for different cleaning needs. Fisco have a few different air blowers with built-in filters and this new design to choose from coming in from different price points such as the VB012E tumbler style air blower in this blue colorway for about $18 the last time I checked and you already know the VB03E Falcon S air blower that is about $30. $30 the last time I checked. Price could be less. Check the link down in the description to see what are the new updated price if it's a lot more affordable now. So now that you know that there is a better rocket air blower that is out there that can actually protect your sensors and your high balls if you squirt in here in it. I don't know. I think my job here is done. You can go ahead and find one or the other, whichever one you want, or you can get both like I did. They're really affordable. I don't see why you wouldn't want to take a chance with it because you went ahead and bought the old rocket air blower back in the past. That didn't work out so well. I don't know. If you find this video helpful, then click the like button on your way out and hit my face to get subscribed. And uh, you can come down in the comments and say, thank you, Sensei, for saving my camera and my lenses. Thank you, Sensei. Thank you for watching this video. Boom.